Hello again Tarot Souls, I am Giselle and this is Mad Witch Channel and I've come on to share with you one of the decks that I am particularly excited to get. Now this was purchased, ordered in uh, 2018 but uh, you will have seen many walkthroughs of this but I had to show, uh, we got the larger version and even my husband is saying he might purchase this deck. It it's beautiful and I, I will have to say Pernickety Pixie first mentioned this deck when we were on Simon's Live one day and I went straight on and had a little look and I loved it and I did actually ask around and nobody seemed to be particularly interested in this deck um, look at the size of it I mean I, I don't have big hands but um, that is a big deck it is a superb deck absolutely superb and I did message the creators and they came back to me straight away and I didn't get around to ordering it straight away and I think part of it was because I didn't know enough about what I was really doing it wasn't a deck that was out there already and I didn't know which one I wanted and I, I wanted you know the more expensive version but I couldn't really justify it there and then and when it came out and it exploded onto the tarot scene as far as i'm concerned um it and when it came yesterday and i do want to do this justice because i was going to do this up the other way and if this turns out to be naffy nunas i might do that um my husband said to me this might well be the best deck that you've got and I know what he means I know exactly what he means because the artwork is stunning and I th I think there are um, plenty of walkthroughs now of this deck where you can see it in much more detail if mine's not doing it for you but um, we went through it yesterday my husband and I and we couldn't find a, a card that we didn't like it's just brilliant it's just the card stock is lovely i'm so so grateful to him for getting me um the bigger cards if you were going to have it with any of them this is the deck you want it with and i'd like shadowscapes to be like this i think the czech version might be which i'm still trying to get hold of it's just incredible Everything about um, the images is just so cool. Isn't he just wonderful? I just love him so much. And I, I, you know, I nearly didn't get this deck and I'm so glad I did. What? <laughs> I mean, what? Everything you, you kind of hope she... <laughs> sure I want to meet her but look at that for the hangman I mean the colors are really lovely I absolutely adore this death card can you believe this deck it's just gorgeous oh she is beautiful look at that devil card and the way the color you know you've got that predominantly dark black image <laughs> there's his tower card it's just gorgeous look at that it's the weasley house almost but just not falling down that well it did didn't it so there you go the star she's so ethereal stunning um <clears throat> my soul deck and i, I I kind of think I'm probably right when I say it is the Lily White. Um, we've all probably got one, and but this deck I think will be a best friend for a long, long time. I hope I can read it. I hope it's got so much going on that I I think that you you can't not the Ace of Wands, huh? And I, as I say, there are plenty of walkthroughs, I know, 
and I do keep saying that I'm not going to do walkthroughs and I'm not going to do walkthroughs normally but I have to share this one because like you know who doesn't want to go I've got the dark mansion tarot because it's just that deck and Simon's going to have that deck soon too if he hasn't already <laughs> I love the eight of wands actually I think this is just so much fun It's, I mean, yeah, I would love backup decks and I know Simon's done a VR, which I'm, you know, I, I don't have backup decks for anything. <laughs> that worries me so much. But um, if I was going to have a backup deck, I think I'd have a backup deck of this. I mean, I've got the Lily Black and the Lily White and that's kind of like a just... It's, it's just going to be with me all the time. I've, it comes in such a lovely box that I... But I need to make it a bag because it probably... Although I say that, I don't know. Would I, would I use that deck for other people? It's so personal to me. I had a relationship with it so quickly. That said, there is another deck that I have um, started to formulate a relationship with. And that is the Tower of the Vampires. And I want to, I would like to do a walkthrough of that. Um, I did an interview with that deck uh, yesterday and it was really good. <laughs> I'm just so lucky to have these decks. I'm so lucky that in less than a year my husband has been so kind I think I've been moving away from the camera haven't I to to allow me this great indulgence and I he said to me you know yeah okay you might be breaking the bank he said but I've never seen you so happy and so enjoying you know what you're doing for so long and you know I my children are grown now and I love all of them and my grandchildren I love them all but this is my time now I am 100% into the crone uh, phase and I really really want to just enjoy it because this is it for me this is all I've got now and I I do like this version of the three of hearts there's lots of hair in there so you know I want to enjoy it and my passion is still yeah okay m money might be dwindling but the passion isn't um, so amazing so yeah I'm probably as I say there's a couple of decks that I want to get I think I might have mentioned that in the last video Marseille decks actually <laughs> he's cute <laughs> so easy just to get lost in these cards and not actually um, remember to speak <laughs> maybe that's not a bad thing <laughs> so I will be doing an interview I've got quite a, I've got a couple of interviews I've got to write up actually and I put one that I did for the green witch that cat very very generously gave me um, I put that up on Instagram because I can now because I've understood the process although I'm still not I'm not au fait with it not really but I, I, I can do certain things I 
and after this I'm going to get myself a glass of wine or maybe a cup of tea I'm not sure yet. maybe a glass of wine and I'm going to write up I've got so much to do I, I, I did this big chakra reading this morning and I haven't finished that and I've got these interviews to write up and more to do and then I've got to sort through these videos and put them up um, but not all at once oh. so this was just my homage to this beautiful deck the creators have done a well I can't find a card I don't like in this deck either um, they are just uh, spot on they're great fun that there's so much going on and yet it's clear enough for you to easily pick up the colors are lovely the cardstock is beautiful I am very very happy to have this deck and I would recommend it it's got this lovely gilding along the edge but I think hubby wants one now and that's you know never buys a deck that I've got so guys I'm going to say that's it for now I might have another couple and then hopefully I will have finished my batch um, videoing and I will see you uh, in the spring <laughs> well I don't know I might come back on but I you know I think um, like I said I want to put out content that's actually uh, some got something going for it rather than just waffling which is what I do very well okay much love take care bye bye she says my mouse stuck. <laughs>